So this is an absolutely gorgeous sunny day here today. So I've I've got a soft spot for this car, right? So this is one of our competition cars. A couple of weeks ago, we gave away a red um, MGB Roadster, which went really, really well. Uh, this one, I think, has gone even better than the last one, uh, which we kind of unexpected. We weren't sure whether it would or not. Uh, but as it's such a stunning day, we thought we would take the MGB out for a drive, talk about it, because one of the things I think personally about this car, this is one of the nicest, certainly the nicest MGBs I've ever driven, probably one of the nicest classic cars. I've ever driven and I've driven a lot. Um, I don't know why, I think it's the power steering, I think it's the sound, I just think the way it drives is really nice. Um, so we'll take it out and I'll talk you through what we're gonna do. What's a real shame is we literally just flicked the cameras off as the red arrows flew over the top. We didn't know they were coming, but um, don't see that every day when you've uh, got a camera near you. Annoyingly, like I say, we just turned the cameras off as they, uh, as they flew over the top. This is um, our part of the world. This is Pettistry near Woodbridge in Suffolk. And we thought we'd go for a little drive just because it's a lovely day. It's supposed to rain later today, so we thought well, let's take it out and, um, and give it a drive. This is possibly one of the nicest MGBs I've ever driven. Um, the power steering, I think, is absolutely spot on for this car. I kind of get from this car why an MGB wouldn't be my first choice. No reason, I mean, I like German BMWs, I've got a Mercedes SL myself, so it kind of wouldn't be my first choice, but for so many people, it is the first choice, and I think this car, I totally get why from this car. Um, it goes through the gears absolutely lovely, it sounds lovely, the fact that it's a glorious sunny day um, and we've got the roof off, that kind of makes it really nice as well. Uh, so this is going to sell out possibly today um, and it's not actually due to sell out for a couple of weeks so it's gone really well and it just shows that MGBs work really well for, uh, for you guys at home, you kind of like us doing them. I wouldn't want to do it all the time um, but you know, we had that one that sold out well, we've now got this one that sells out um, just as well. So we're now driving into Woodbridge. Which, if you're not from around here, Woodbridge is really pretty. You've got Felix, though, Southwold, Oldborough, Lower Stoft, Great Yarmouth. They're kind of all on, on our coast. So it's a really nice part of the world to be and to have a car like this in a place like this. It just, it makes sense. That's why you see a lot of classic cars around this area. So if you're into your classic cars, you know everything you need to know about an MGB. It ticks all of the boxes for a classic car owner. But one of the things I would say, if you're not, and that's one of the beautiful things about competitions, um, that it's not just for the classic car real enthusiasts and owners, it's for people who, you know, perhaps um, haven't got the budget to go out and buy a classic car completely outright. That is the MGB is a really, really good example of of a really good startup classic car. It drives like a modern car within reason, so it's not too scary. It's not very old that you're going to struggle to start it every five minutes. But it's not, you know, but it's got the look of a classic car. It's got the chrome work that you would expect. Um, and it's days like this is where a classic car is appreciated. If you're new to the classic car world, this is a really good starter car um, to enjoy. MGs as a whole, the nice thing about it, if you want to try and work on them yourself, you kind of can with an MG. Um, parts are readily available. There's a lot of companies out there that you can get MGP parts for. There's a lot of companies that have worked like us that have worked on MGBs that will always be there to help you. So it's a huge community around MGs. So this would be a brilliant starter classic for someone who's uh, new to the world but has always wanted one.